can do it, put your back into it. I can do it on your mm, mm, mm. <laughs> What's up guys, it's your girl Athena. Today's drink is going to be Colbert Margarita, okay? Hopefully I'm pronouncing it right. It's C-O-B-A-L-T Margarita. Colbert, 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 Colbert. <laughs> I'm 29. Today's ingredients is going to be lime wedges, sea salt, <laughs> sea salt, ice cubes, tequila. Uh, okay, this pronunciation. Brace yourself. Contrial you. Oh, this is French. Um, coats. Help me. <laughs> Coin tree you. Coin tree you. Help me, nigga. I don't know how to pronounce this. Contra you. It's not, it's not like the closest pronunciation. Cointreau. Yes, your margarita is made with Blanco tequila, Cointreau, and fresh lime juice. It's unopened as well. Blue Carico, the other word I can't pronounce correctly. Lime juice and grapefruit juice. Since I don't have grape juice, I decided to use Cran Raspberry Ocean Spray. So before I continue, make sure you guys go and hit that like and subscribe button along with that bell notification button so you guys know when I'm coming out with the next video. I have been making a lot of drink videos lately. This is really freaking good, oh my God. I wish I had more rum. But this is not the only content that I wish to put out. So with that being said, I will be releasing different content, but as for now, we are still going to be doing drinks. Mm. There are so many options. So let's begin. Moisten the rim of a chilled margarita glass with a lime wedge and frost with the sea salt. See page 144. Put the ice cubes into a cocktail shaker. Add all of the remaining ingredients and shake until a frost forms on the outside of the shaker. Strain into the glass. Decorate with a lime, rind, spiral, and serve. But long story short, basically put everything in the shaker. But this part actually I've always wanted to do so I've never actually like made a margarita rim. Turn to page 395. Oh. oh, so that's how you do it. Put some lime or juice in water in a saucer and dip the rim on the glass into it. Now dip the glass into the sugar or salt, again using a saucer, twisting it around for even coverage. This is what the picture looks like. To get a saucer and then put the salt on it and then like twist it a little bit. I'm gonna attempt to do it. So I'm gonna be ghetto and use my clipboard. It won't work though, because it has to be in a pan. Damn it. <laughs> I'm gonna use a bowl. So then we're gonna cut the lime juicer. It's not as tiring as it used to be. First of all, I hit that <laughs> right angle. Don't play me. I love these noises. You nasty. Anyway. Okay, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take my glass. Dip the glass in here. I see the rim. You can see it a little bit on here. I'm go like this, get some salt, put it on the thing, and then I'm gonna go like this. Okay, this is really messy. <laughs> I just went like that too. Hey, look at me go. Oh my God, that's so much salt. <laughs> Salty as hell. All right, so this is how it looks. <laughs> now it's time for the drink. So I'm gonna be putting it in the shaker. I'm not gonna be using the exact measurements, but I'm still gonna tell you guys what the measurements are. So I'm gonna have some ice cubes right here. That's the thing. A few moments later. Summer. Two hours later. Good God Almighty. One eternity later. What the? F I got one of them out. <laughs> Instead of using four, I'm gonna use three, and then a measurement of tequila. So according to my friends, I need to stop measuring this stuff. But this is what the instruction is calling for. So I'm gonna be using Jose Cuervo. I'm gonna be using a measurement in a half. So it calls for two teaspoons of the cured cube. I don't know how to pronounce it, but you know you gotta tap the bottom of the bottle. Never had this before. I got this on sale at the next. It smells like oranges. Two teaspoons. Oh, it's clear. That's what she said. Oh, shit. Oops. We need half a measurement of blue curico. 
So since I only have a little bit left, I'm just gonna pour the rest of this in here. Should be enough for this shaker anyway. Now, lime juice. I don't wanna do the other lime, my hand hurt. <laughs> but it calls for three fourths measurement of lime juice. Good amount, I'm gonna pour this into the shaker. And last but not least, we're gonna throw in some cran raspberry. I just poured it to the top, that was about to leak over. Now we gonna shake. Anyway. Wow. 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 It smells interesting. The moment of truth. <laughs> this looks horrible, but whatever. It's purple. Purple drink. I don't know how to feel about this, but this is very pretty. <laughs> this is the Colbert Margarita. Um, I don't know, but it is pretty, so we're gonna give this a go. This is a lot of salt. <laughs> but you know, we'll give it a try. Hmm. So my battery died <laughs> while I was actually testing the drink and lo and behold, um, it is as bad as that last frame shows. It was extremely salty because I put way too much salt on the rim of that glass. Live and you learn. I did like it the first couple of sips that I had from it, but then after a while it started tasting like beer and I'm not a big fan of beer. So yeah, I wouldn't really recommend that one. So thank you guys so much for watching this video. I really do appreciate it. Make sure you guys go and hit that like and subscribe button. And you know why you need to hit that bell notification button? Because I did another drinking video. But this time it is very different. Me and my friend Z did a citizenship test and for every question that we got wrong, we took shots slash sips. Oh, I was rubbing alcohol. Oh. Let's just say by the end of it, uh, we were a little drunk. <laughs> I come from an immigrant family. So do I. Yeah. Mm. Oh, I'm really strong. Guys. <coughs> this tastes like nail polish. Then stop drinking it. <laughs> How many amendments does the Constitution have? Ten. What are the two parts of the government? It's the House of Representatives and... Shock oh. making. <laughs> two Focus! Now. The idea of self-government is the first three words of the Constitution. What are these words? Oh, uh, pursuit the of happiness. Liberty and the pursuit, pursuit of happiness. Oh, I have Preamble.